is with the Premier and her ministers, and I'm going to ask this question. If the government of Ontario has downloaded things like the highways and like housing to the City of Toronto, and if the City of Toronto Act was meant to allow us to have the means to pay for some of those kinds of things, and if you are now telling us that some of those powers given under the City of Toronto Act are to be denied to us, in fact, a number of them are based on discussions I've had with her, a liquor tax, for example, they've basically made impractical for us to even think about. And so if that's going to be the case, then I want to know what the plans are for you to support social housing, for example and what the plans are to go beyond the gas tax uh, increment announced today, which is welcomed, uh, because we need more than this to address $33 billion in unfunded projects that have been sitting around here for decades. I've said before, uh, I don't intend to be the mayor that leaves City Hall with that number having reached some other much higher number. I intend to be the mayor that gets on with my council colleagues to building these things, and that involves paying for it because people know it's not free, and that involves um, us being prepared to step up, which we were prepared to do, and it involves the province clearly now doing more uh, in light of the fact they've denied us the opportunity to do something we democratically uh, said we would do.